Hey guys, it's Deanna and Chelsea of VXT and we are going to answer your questions. Again. Again. <laughs> Part two. Two. Okay. Um, so we're going to read them off my phone and we'll pass it back and forth. But the first question is from Jake M. Larson and he asked us, what is the best piece of advice another wrestler has ever given you? Okay, you answer first Ooh. so I can think about it. Um, well, Sean Bennett is a referee, but I'm going to say he counts for this one because he used to be my wrestling trainer. And uh, he told me like six years ago, um, and I'll never forget it, uh, to surround yourself with uh, people you aspire to be like. Oh, that's a good yeah. one. Yeah. And while you were, I knew like once you started talking, it would come to me. Um, I'll never forget when I was Megan Miller on Raw and um, Nikki Bella and Natty came up to me and said like, just whatever you do, Wow, there's a huge flyaway. Oh no, that's the car. <laughs> Whatever you do, like, don't give up. Just keep trying, keep pushing, keep messaging them, keep, you know, like, yeah. and I, that's something that I take with me. I think we do that now at NXT. Yeah. You know I what have I mean? So many questions. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, okay. Next one is What is your favorite ride at Disney and why? Okay, mine, that's so easy for me. Um, in Florida, mine is Tower of Terror. And why? I don't know. It's just my favorite. I love it. <laughs> I love the line. I love like the pre-ride stuff, and I love the ride. And it never gets old. Yeah. Okay. Um. I think. Well, when I first read the question earlier, Space Mountain came to mind. So maybe I'll just go with that. Um. Because. Yeah, that's a good one. Like, so this is wrestling related, but when I was little, that was like Ric Flair's favorite <laughs> ride. So I wanted to ride it for like the longest time, and now I just. I don't know, it reminds me of being a kid and going to Disney and, and whatever, but I also love the teacups. Like, teacups have been my favorite ride since I was little. Yeah, oh, the teacups are cute. Yeah. Okay. All right. This one's uh, a good one. The next one is, um, oh wow, I don't know how to say C-O-C. C-O-C. C-O-C-I-T. W? This person <laughs> says, well, Malcolm Bivens manage VXT and that is going to be a big fat no. No! <laughs> Maybe Stokely Hathaway had he not died or whatever happened to him but yeah. Malcolm Bivens is going to be no. no. He's already dead to us so. No. Um, okay I can't see who did this one. Oh at Chai Tac Wow! <laughs> can you just We should have rehearsed. Yeah! <laughs> okay. How old were you when you realized that you wanted to be a pro wrestler? And when and where did you train? So I realized when I was like 24, not that long ago. <laughs> so it's kind of embarrassing because I already know what Deanna's going to say. Um, but I trained in Calgary, Alberta, Canada with Lance Storm. Um, Chelsea and I like to joke that... <laughs> Growing up, I would have hated her. 100%. 100%. <laughs> because I wanted to be a wrestler since I was like nine. And um, I trained with Damien Adams in Wharton, New Jersey. Uh, but I, I like it took me a long time to accept people that didn't want to be a wrestler. <laughs> but now we're surrounded by like that. So I'm actually not the worst. Yes, no. <laughs> and I've come to terms with that. Like I came to terms with a long time ago. But yeah. like it's okay for people to be in wrestling to decide they, they want to wrestle at, like, at 36 years old more power to you <laughs> <laughs> okay anyway um uh Al alvary bay bay asked us uh cat or dog person oh man i know everyone thinks that i'm a cat person obviously but actually no. back home i had dogs i had both i had a pig so you i'm just chickens. an animal yeah chickens i'm just an animal animal person in general yeah um I love your cats because they're my nephews. But yeah, like, little babies. I'm very allergic to them, so that's why I'm not a cat person because yeah. I die when I come to your Matt's house. Um, and I have two dogs, so I'm a dog person. Yeah, I mean, Winston and, and Fitzy Boy. Yeah, definitely. Okay, at Rocky Faith V1, that was the easiest was easy. one. <laughs> What's your favorite snacks to eat on the road? Ooh, you're gonna say popcorn. Yeah, hundred percent popcorn. <laughs> I could eat popcorn for breakfast, lunch, dinner. Salty, sweet, salty and sweet, cheesy, I don't oh, care. Oh, cheesy popcorn. Yeah. Um, I, I really like gummies. Any kind of gummy? They're like, ugh, I love nuts. So, 
Okay, like, like um, worms and stuff? Yeah, gummy worms, sour watermelon, ca ca uh, sour patch, whatever they're called, peach yeah. rings. Oh. oh, wow, Skittles. Smart um, sweets. Yeah. Any, Hook it uh, up, smart sweets. But I also really like chips, so like some any kind of barbecue chip. Is it smart sweet or sweet smart? Smart sweet. I hope I said that right. Okay, and last but not least, the best our, question of them all. We didn't do this on purpose either, it just worked out this way. So, Dr. Britt Baker DMD asked us if you could add a fourth member to the group, who would it be and why? We have a list, but obviously, our girl Britt is at the top of the list. And then, uh, let's give a couple more examples. Oh, uh, Britt. Uh, Britt, obviously. They were tag partners forever, she's our other best friend. She completes uh, our group of yeah. best friends. So yeah. Um, otherwise, Karen Q is also our other best friend. So Santana, newly signed at NXT. NXT. Uh, yeah. It's a possibility now. The dream team. Um, Candice. Yeah, definitely. We just discussed that earlier, and Candice definitely yeah. fits the whole VXT vibe. I think. Um, I think that's really that's it. Like yeah. those are the girls that. Um, I mean, those three definitely are real possibilities. Yeah. Britt's like the dream member, you know? Yeah. And she's just going to be a permanent member of VXT in or out of... She's like, uh, like she's in VXT through spirit. Yes, exactly. Um, I, I guess I did not favorite it on Twitter to ask, but we were also asked how Rachel's doing and oh, how yeah. her recovery is doing. And um, she's great. She's at the PC. She's walking without crushes. Dude, she's she, squatting? Yes, I was just going to say she did body weight presses the other day like she's great she's in good spirits she um is setting goals and accomplishing them for herself so yeah we, she's killing it i'm sure she'll come back um quicker than she hopes i mean we hope yeah. but everybody just tweet her send her your you know send well wishes yeah. yeah and we'll have to get her in one of these videos soon okay well part three coming soon thanks guys bye